Hi guys, it's Christina from Redefine Creative and I have a new process video for you today and this is using the new Paint Paisley Outfitters collection. And if you watched my previous video, you know that I was not very happy with how that layout turned out. And so I wanted to continue using this collection because I really, really love the collection. There was just something about that first layout that was not my favorite. And this one I actually end up really liking. So I have taken this giant cut file from the cut shop and I am uh, backing it with this yellow pattern paper and all of this is from the Outfitters collection. And I like that this has an ombre look to it and it actually goes really well with the pictures that I'm going to be scrapbooking today. So I'm just going to go ahead and back it with that color and then I'm going to use the triangular paper as my background. And if you notice I took the two uh, strips and use those across the top of the page just some, to add some extra detail and color up there. And now you're going to see I'm going to try and put four pictures on this layout and I actually end up choosing three. Um, but these are some pictures of my sons from Boy Scout camp and he had the opportunity this year to learn how to use a compass to actually kind of find coordinates and directions and they had this entire challenge course set up. So the kids were given a bunch of different coordinates and they had to use a compass to leave a line that went through the middle of camp at a certain location and then it brought them back to a different location and they could check in with their um, troop leaders to see if they had done everything correctly and ended up in the correct spot. And since my son is so much about like rules and precision and exactly how things are supposed to be done, he thought this was like the best activity at camp. Um, so all the other boys have pretty much moved on to other things and games and running around like crazy and my son of course is continuing to do this course throughout the day and wanted me to go with him and then his dad to go with him and then he's got a friend to go with him because he wanted to make sure that he was doing everything precisely and was getting the correct answers. Um, so right now what you'll see I'm doing is I've pulled out some of the ephemera packs from the Outfitters collection and I'm just playing with where I'm going to place those. I'm going to go ahead and put those label strips back up at the top and then I'm going to start kind of composing the rest of this layout. I pulled out a sticker sheet and this is from an old basic gray collection called Carte Postal and a lot of the colors matched really well so I actually used that sticker strip and then I'm going to add some other sticker details later on as well. And here I'm just going to start composing everything together and I put the cut file kind of centered right in the middle because I do want it to mimic the compass that this whole page is talking about. And then I'm going to line these three photos up across the middle of that compass um, so that you still see all of the directional markers, the north, south, east, and west. And I do go back and add some pen stitching when I do my journaling so that the compass directions and everything does stand out a little bit better and you will be able to see that at the end. And then I've taken some of the 6x6 um, pattern papers and put them underneath that photo, underneath that series of photos to kind of create a little bit of a ledge. And now I'm just playing with the different stickers and embellishments. You see I have that uh, tag at the top that kind of has like a map pattern. And then I'm pulling some of those other little sticker details from that basic gray collection. And that Explorers Unite badge, the, those are the new leather badges from that Outfitters collection and they are absolutely gorgeous. They're nice and thick and very detailed and I love them. I just actually just got them. Um, so I end, end up moving that down to the bottom left corner and it's actually going to stay down there and become my title. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut off just the edges of those extra branding strips that were up at the top and the bottom and put some of those die cuts on. Then I'm looking through the sticker pack trying to decide some little details I want to add and you'll be able to see those a lot better in the close-up photos at the end. Um, but I'm just looking for phrases that will work for what my son is doing. So the fact that he is working with this compass. So the ones up there at the top say find your own way and explorers unite. And then I am going to add just a couple other little uh, phrases or stickers. There's one, the one that's in my hand right now says wander and it's going to end up actually going in that middle photo in the bottom corner. And now you'll see I pulled out some wood veneer pieces and I bought these a long time ago that have some camping phrases on them and so I put one of those in each one of those clusters. And that's going to do it for this layout. So here you are going to be able to see some close-ups of those details 
and the different embellishments that I've added, I am much more happy with this layout, and I hope you enjoyed watching my process and it inspired you. Um, if you did, like and subscribe below. Have a good day. Bye!